everyone, so I thought I would film a, another little clothing haul for you as I've been into town and picked up a few bits. It's mostly Primark but I got a couple of bits from New Look and I also went into Dorothy Perkins so I thought I'd put it all together and just put it into one big haul for you. So yeah, just keep watching. So I have this massive Primark bag. So I'm going to put that... Uh, yeah, let's delve in. Um, Okay, so I'm going to do the stuff that I got from Primark first, so I'll tell you the price of everything as I go through. So, um, first things first. Oh, none of it's on the hanger. That's going to be really annoying. Oh well. The first thing that I bought was this leather jacket, or fake leather, I'm guessing, since it's Primark. Um, it just looks like this. I'm not sure how well you'll be able to see. It's sort of just... I like the fact that it's got like a collar and it's just a black leather jacket with some zip details and it's long sleeved, long sleeved. <laughs> but yeah I just really like this and I've been wanting a leather jacket for ages and it was only £14. I know obviously this isn't going to last as long as a real leather jacket but for £14 I don't really mind. But I just thought this would be really nice now that we're going more into spring so I don't want to be carrying like a massive coat around. So yeah, I picked that one up, that was £14. The next thing that I got was, I picked up this dress. Uh, I've seen this in somebody else's Primark haul and I love anything with like flowers on and I just really liked it so I thought I'd pick it up. It's this dress and it's black and it's got little yellow and white flowers, I'm not sure how well you can see. But it's got like a high collar and then it has little short sleeves and it's just like a nice little a-line sort of dress so it sort of goes tight in and then well, not sure how I'll be able to show this but it has like a little floaty skirt part I thought this would look really pretty with tights and some black boots and maybe with the leather jacket as well and that one was £13 bargain I really like the material of this as well it's quite a thin material so it'd be really good for the summer as well the next thing that I bought was I just bought this grey top, it's quite basic but it has a nice black collar and it's this sort of like, is it ribbed? Do you call it ribbed? It's got like lines down it um, but it's just a short sleeved top. I just thought that would be really nice for day to day wear and that one was £7. It has like a little keyhole at the back uh, but mine is actually broken uh, but it was the last one they had in store so I thought I'd pick it up anyway and I'll just put like a little stitch on it and it'll be fine. Um, but yeah, I really like that one. That one was £7, but because it was slightly damaged, they gave me, I think it was like a pound off or something, so it was like £6. I picked up this, which is like a... This is just a really thin sort of jumper. I would probably wear it with like a strap top underneath. Um, but it's quite, a th it's quite a thin material, but it's just black cottony jumper. But I really like this crisscross detail on the front. Let me move the tag and you might be able to see. And it just has sort of like a crisscross style, um, but I like the gold detailing on it. But yeah, I got this in a size up so that it would be slightly looser fitting because I didn't want it to be too tight. But yeah, I really like that one. That was £8. Is this. And holding it up isn't going to do it justice, but it's this like yellow mustardy top. Or blouse you might call it, yeah. Yellow blouse, mustardy coloured blouse. And it's just got a collar again. Um, I seem to have had a thing for like this sort of material because it's the same as the dress. Um, but yeah, it's three quarter lengths and it just has these rolled up uh, buckled sleeves, which I thought was really nice. And it has pockets on the front. I just thought this was really nice and it's slightly longer at the back so it would look really nice with leggings or high waisted jeans. I just thought this would be really nice again for sort of a transition into win from winter into spring. That one was... £10. Yeah, next thing that I bought was, this is very similar to the yellow top that I've just shown you, khaki green shirt dress and again buckled three quarter sleeves and the pockets on the front but again it's just a lot longer and I tried this on with tights and some boots and it looked really nice. This one was £13. The second to last thing I bought in Primark were these. And they're just some little pumps. They're like a, what would you call this? Like an orangey brown. These were only £4, so I thought I'd pick them up because I'll get loads of use out of them. I always wear 
dolly shoes, so it's really handy, um, and they're quite comfy. And for four pounds, I couldn't really not get them. Next thing that I bought from Primark, I'm actually wearing um, blue skinny jeans, uh, but they're really stretchy, so they're super comfy. They're not tight around the waist or anything. And yeah, I think these were ten pounds. Let me check for a seat. Yeah, they were ten pounds jeans. Um, but yeah, I really like these. For ten pounds, you can't really go wrong. They're super comfy and they're tight fitting. And for me, I'm quite short, so. They don't bunch up too much at the end, which is always a good thing. So yeah, that's everything that I got from Primark. So moving on to... Oh, I'll move on to Dorothy Perkins, actually. I only bought one thing in Dorothy Perkins, which is this green off-the-shoulder top, which you can see I'm wearing right now. I just really like this because I thought it'd be really nice for in the summer. Just an off-the-shoulder, khaki green again t-shirt. And it's just... It's not super tight-fitting, but it's not too loose either. But I just thought this would be really nice for the summer and for layering up so I think, let me see, this was yeah, this top was £10 so that was a really good deal moving on to the stuff I got from New Look I picked up two pairs of shoes from New Look that were in the sale first pair that I picked up are these I picked up these black boots which are just slightly heeled and they have a little silver buckle on the side there and they're like this sort of suede material and they have like the little stretchy sides so that you can slip it onto your foot easily. This would be really good for everyday use and they were on sale for £12 so I couldn't resist. Couldn't resist a boot bargain. The second pair of boots that I got are these. I feel like these are going to be kind of like you'll either love them or hate them. So they look like this. They're sort of like a they're sort of like a wedged train. They remind me of Timberland style boots but in black because they've got the laces and they look very sort of like boot like but then they're wedged uh, but I love these these are like my perfect kind of shoe I live in boots and wedges so for me these are brilliant but I just really like these and again these were in the sale and they were £12 as well so these were usually £27.99 and the other boots are usually £24.99 so I basically got two pairs of boots for the price of one of them normally so that was a complete bargain so I got two lots of boots there yeah so that's everything that I bought in my little haul for you I hope you guys liked it and enjoyed it let me know what your favorite item was down below what videos you'd like to see from me next again sorry that I haven't uploaded in ages I've been super distracted and procrastinating really um, but I'm gonna try and get back into my channel and upload more regularly for you guys I just struggle with ideas for videos so let me know what sort of things you'd like to see down below it would really help me out for what to film for you in future. Give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. Thank you so much for watching. Bye! See you with another video again. And I'll see you with another video. I'll see you with another video. I'll see you with... Uh.